Rich Spisano here from Digitally Fearless, and I thought it would be fun to see how we can do a quick beard, not quite a beard, but maybe a little scruff. So for example, turn this, give this guy a little bit of scruff like that. I can add more or take away more. So let me show you how, so let's get started. So the first thing I did was I pulled in the stock photo from Pixels from Nathan Cowley. Cowley, I can't see the names, let me see. C-O-W-L-E-Y. So I pulled it in and I brought it into here. And this is really a quick down and dirty tutorial. I'm gonna actually delete all of these that I did before and I'm back right to the person here. So you add a new pixel layer and then you need to pick, go to the paintbrush and it's a round paintbrush and give it full hardness, full flow. And you need to choose a medium gray uh, which is 50% black. And then just with your brackets, go bigger or smaller, right bracket, left bracket, and you start painting where you think the beard will be. Now you can fix that later, so don't be, you don't have to be so perfect here. So I'm just gonna go around the chin here and maybe a little smaller as I get up to his sideburns. Uh, let's go like that. And see how we can make this look and I'm just gonna keep painting I'll go bigger I'm just gonna paint where I think it would be I'm gonna erase some of that afterwards of course but for now this is how I'm gonna end up doing it and we'll also give him we want him to have scruff so we also want him to have a mustache scruff and that's close enough for now like I said we can always get rid of some of that so now we take that and we go to, we can go to live filters and we can add noise somewhere here. Hmm, here we go, add noise. And we want it to be monochromatic and Gaussian. And let's just bring it way up like that. So it's not very pretty. Now we take that and we give it a soft light. And already we have a little bit. So now, now the next thing I like to do, give it just a little bit more flare, is I duplicate Control or Command J, and I'm going to rasterize that layer to soften it up a little bit. And then I can also go again to Filter, Blur, Motion Blur, and maybe a little bit on a, di a different angle, and apply that. So now I could duplicate this many times, I can also go to curves if I want to change the curves. If I want to darken it or lighten it a little bit. I can go light. If I want a gray beard kind of added to it, or I can go like that. Or if I want a darker beard, something like that would work. And so that's it. So that's a quick way to add a beard or really to add scruff to someone. In the end, you can also combine them all and mask it. And if you want to just trim this down like you're shaving him, you can also do that too. So I hope you liked this tutorial. And if you did, please click like and subscribe. And please have a good day. Bye.